Hi everyone, I'm so excited to be sharing with you my outdoor patio decor for the fall. We have a small little patio or deck um, in our backyard that I love to transition for the season. So I'm going to share with you some decorating tips and how I've changed this space for a cozy fall area. So first of all, on the steps, I have these maroon mums and I've used so many thrifted items. I love using thrifted decor, that's the best way to go. Um, the mums are from Aldi, so I have eight different mums and they're right now currently like $3.29, but when I got them they were $2.69, so they're on sale for some reason. So super affordable to get those mums, so go get those now if you can. And then I just put um, some little white pumpkins that I grew myself and I do have a faux white pumpkin here that I spray painted but when real pumpkins are more available I would love to have some color, some orange, some green, um, some other white ones too out on my deck but for now I'm just using the faux to show you what it could look like. Um, and growing your own is a really affordable way to do it. So I got a ton of mini white pumpkins, which I love using. So I used this galvanized bucket I found thrifted years ago and just put a mum in there. And then I just incorporated a lot of natural elements. I used, of course, a variety of mum colors. I like to have outdoor be the actual true fall colors. Inside I'm a little more neutral with decor. So I um, used another galvanized bucket I had for my yellow mums and then this adorable apple bucket that I found at a garage sale was 50 cents so I used that here on my back patio. Um, then a couple more pumpkins of course, this orange one that I did grow grew correctly this time. I only got one little orange pumpkin. And then I uh, just yeah, incorporated a lot of color with my mom's and that's just such a simple way to do it. I left the rest of my patio decor, my black stand, put um, a crock that I had thrifted years and years ago on there. And I grew my own sunflowers this year. So what a natural way to use some more color and just some fall style with real sunflowers in this thrifted crock. And then again, more pumpkins. I can't get enough of those pumpkins. Uh, below this stool behind me, I used just some antlers I had from um, or some deer sheds that my dad had found. More pumpkins and then this little candle holder I found garage sailing years ago as well. And I'll show you the evening scene later, but it's just so beautiful, so cozy to have that. And then of course on my chair I have a thrifted throw with some burgundy and cream color. Just if you're sitting outside on a chilly evening to cozy up with that. And I just thought that drew in the warmth. And then on my other side, I have another bigger galvanized bucket with some yellow mums in it. And I left my fern for now because it's still warm. As you can tell, I'm in short sleeves. It's still warm out and I wanted to get as much life from this fern as possible. But using crates and baskets, they are all thrifted items just to get that rustic outdoor element. On my chair, I added a thrifted pillow to incorporate some more of that um, color. And my cushion for my summer decor, I hadn't had it yet for my summer decor for a patio. It was an old orange one. This is a red one from Walmart. So that really just incorporates fall color really true. And then some orange moms, another antler shed, and then I left my rosemary herb on this table just because I wanted to have a little green on this side of the chair as well. So truly super simple, um, just rearranging a little bit, adding a different color, different textures, makes it so cozy, so homey. And in the evening I lit a few candles, I have my railing with some LED Christmas lights, wanted to have a little more elegance, you could get the Edison bulb lights and hang that above. But I just love sitting out here in the evening, especially now that it's cooling down and just cozying up with a little blanket, seeing the candles flicker in the night. And again, it's so budget friendly, just really the mums is all I bought. So I hope this inspires you to decorate outside for the fall. 
stay tuned for more fall decorating videos in the next several weeks. I'm so excited to bring those to you. So I would love to have you subscribe if you haven't yet and give this video a like. So talk with you in the next video. Love you guys.